So you have free ices too? Enjoying every minute of this. Mm-hmm. Free Rice Krispie treats, <laughs> ices, chips. This is probably going to be one of my top five things that you could do with a family. a.m. to be precise but today is something that's really special because today is the day we finally give our kids their Christmas present because we value experiences over things and so for Christmas this year we gave the kids a day at Discovery Cove here in Central Florida and since we knew we were gonna be here during these winter months we, we knew that uh, this was gonna be a fun place. So I'm excited that we're gonna have our experience today, finally. Oh my gosh, it's like 5.54 in the morning. Hashtag green happen. I'm excited. You excited? I am too. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. I'm going to hide my excitement. Because if I love my excitement, I'm not only chilling, going bouncing off the walls. The cool thing about Discovery Cove is it's an all-inclusive experience. So things like drinks and food are included as part of our day. So we don't have to worry about packing a lunch or bringing a bunch of extra water along. Um, pretty minimal as far as what you need to bring with you. you and excited? snacks. And it's snacks. Unlimited snacks. <gasps> unlimited snacks. It's every teenager's dream is unlimited snacks. <laughs> Wait a minute. Ooh, look at how pretty that water is. So what thing are you most excited to see today? Dolphins. What are you most excited to see today? Definitely the dolphins. I love dolphins. Yeah. Eventually I think I want to get like another tattoo with a dolphin. Got it. Alright, let's go. This drive out. You are between 14 and 16. Try it on. Try it on, honey. Uh, can I have one of the short ones? What's this? Here, I can post it. The water's very warm. I saw Sean's head tonight. Super warm. Whenever you are feeding, you see a big fish, just take your hands out of the water, take the fish out of the water for your own safety. Okay? Awesome. We started our day with a small group of people feeding the stingrays. It was amazing having these beautiful creatures swimming around, brushing up against our wetsuits with their wing-like bodies. Wearing the wetsuits kept us nice and comfortable while we were in the water. This is definitely an experience our kids will never forget. And we are so thankful to have chosen this particular adventure for our family to enjoy and be together. Used to us feeding them, so we make it really easy for them. If you're pulling your hand away, believe it or not, they do remember that, and then they go to somebody else and they may not come to you again to feed them. So make it easy for them. I'm sorry, but they're a little bit lazy. We've we've uh, we've done that. <laughs> All right. So also, please don't try to pet them when you have your gloves on. When you are done feeding, you're welcome to take a glove off and then pet them. Um, their skin's a little bit sensitive. They have a slime coating, just like fish do. Fish guts. It's a dead fish. Dead fish all over your fingers. 
Hmm? Yeah, there you go. Yeah. There you go. Like, that's not for you. Okay. Now uh, put it down further a little bit. Yeah, down, down. A little. There you go. Here he comes. Oh, he sucked it. Did he suck it out? Right in my hand. Nice. Bro, I'm right here. Let me just lower it. You are feeding. Here comes one. He shook my hand. He shook my hand. Like, like he bumped me and I dropped the fish and he shook my hand. How did he not see that? Yeah, ice cubes. Anybody want ice cubes? I will. I'm addicted to ice cubes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It was on top of you. <laughs> He got angry at me! Oh. Whoa! Okay, I'm sorry, dude. Ah! Oh, I want to go. Here, this one's looking, this one's looking trendy. No. Got it. I didn't see that one. He took it. He took my fish. This one. Here you go. Keep it right up. Why? No. Like, seriously, bro. No. No. The bird's giving you looks. Sure he is. I'm for fish. I just want to know what happens if you fart in your wet suit. Mm -hmm. So we want to thank you so much for uh, spending your time with us, spending your morning with us, and we hope that you had a great time. So whenever you're done, uh, take off those gloves, clip them together, and yeah. give them to me in this bucket. What'd you think, guys? This one, I open the awesome. Thank you. We're gonna go eat because we have to swim with the dolphins. Oh, it's only 8 30. Okay. But 10 o'clock is our dolphin swim. So you have free ICs too? Enjoying every minute of this. Mm hmm. Free Rice Krispie treats, mm -hmm. ices, chips. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> Get the fresh air. So many of you. I can't see like my head, That's but funny. I can see like my watch. Little bitty french fries. They're french fry bits. Yeah. <laughs> like they were made for me. dolphin kind of like tow us through the water and just pet the dolphin and interact with the dolphin and they're just such cool cool amazing creatures this is one of those experiences that when you come here you will remember it for the rest of your life like it's a lifetime memory and even dakota earlier when we were walking asked <laughs> mom is this a once in a long time experience or is this a once in a lifetime experience and it really kind of depends on, you know, what you choose to do. But this is definitely one of those things for us that's a once in a long time thing where it's been a lot of fun so far. We would probably want to come back at some point. 
but it is on the higher end of the budget. <laughs> so it's one of those things where this was our kids' Christmas present. So that's where we save those resources throughout the year and choose to buy an experience versus just buying more things. But awesome, all inclusive with food and beverage. So we actually kind of overpacked. They even provide towels, which I brought towels. We didn't need to. So you can really just kind of walk in with maybe an extra pair of clothes if you want. And that's about it. It's all you need. Everything else is provided for you, which is just awesome. So when we were in the water with the dolphins, the trainers actually told us that the way that they train the dolphins, part of the training they do, is they teach them to ignore any sort of input from any individual other than the trainer. Oh. Sometimes, so Sometimes. if you go up and you tap your foot in the water or something like that, they're trained to ignore that. Oh, cool. They will only listen to the trainer or the trainer has some sort of signal that they can give to the dolphin to then like, okay, you watch this person. And then, you know, they tell that person, okay, this is the hand signal or whatever. So the dolphin knows, okay, you're watching this person. But the way that they do that is, it's like they don't want overload. So they train them, don't pay attention to anybody but me. Hmm. what I say, which is interesting. So I feel like all we're doing is eating, eating, eating. And I don't know, I think maybe that's like one of those things with an all-inclusive place. If you've ever done a cruise or something like that, you just eat all the time. So we're eating again now. Lunch. Let's go. Lunch time! You hungry? All right. Hello, chocolate cake. You should probably eat one of those nice green salads, Trinity. Healthier. Oh, Dakota Garrett, it's the melon too. So what is over there? It's like a playground, but water. It's just a wow. and it has it's a cave. A yeah, what? it's a place where we can play. Nice. An underwater playground? That sounds amazing. Cool. Well, let's go check it out. All right, let's go get towels and our circle here, and then we'll go over there and let the kids frolic in the water. <laughs> So one of the cool things that we are seeing about this place when it comes to just things to do in the Orlando area is that because of how that this particular area is set up, you're not experiencing wait times or having to wait in line for things. We were in just a smidge of a line when we got here this morning to just kind of check in. But once that you're checked in, you have an assigned time to go experience the dolphins. We did a stingray feeding experience this morning that we had signed up for extra. It's just very relaxed vibe. So you can just kind of come and go with all of the food stations and the snack stands and get drinks when you want. The kids have just been in a lot of the water areas and there's like a lifeguard every five feet it feels like. Just so much supervision that's happening. Everybody's having a good time. This is probably going to be one of my top five things that you could do with a family in the Orlando area and that goes from whether you've got younger kiddos to even older kiddos there is definitely something here for everyone and it's just a nice relaxed way to spend the day Take a break from life for a while Close my eyes and fly into the moon Close my eyes and fly straight to you Sipping worry by the deep blue So 
Really? Yeah. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. So another really cool thing that they have here is kind of like a lazy river, but it's like a lazy river on steroids where you can actually swim around this loop. You're going through caves, you're going through waterfalls. You can actually get out on this little trail and go see the otters, which is really, really neat. Just a very cool experience of being able to swim around what feels like a river out in nature just because of how everything is and all of the greenery and the trees and the vegetation. It just this whole day has felt like I'm back in Hawaii, which is just incredible. So tons of stuff to do here and tons of stuff we did today. This is definitely an experience like none other and we're so glad that we did it. You feel good thinking something real good, babe. Uh, when I was over there, I found like a sweet spot for stingrays. And the stingrays Speed were like, mm -hmm. they're coming over here and they're coming over here and everywhere. It was crazy. It was fun. Awesome. Even the lifeguard said I found a sweet spot. Sweet spot. Really? Yeah. Like super fun. So what did you think of your Christmas present? I love it. I want to come back next year. Yeah, that's awesome. So do you guys want experiences or do you want things for Christmas next year? Well, it depends. depends for me. For you, it depends. What yeah. do you say? Experience this. Experience. Yeah. yeah. What, what do you want, Dakota? Experiences like this depends. or things? Depends. Depends. He's if a you, teenage boy. Great experience. Would highly recommend this as an experience if you were in the Central Florida area, especially if you were going to be spending the winter months here or something like that. Make sure you put this on your list. This is a reservation only type of day. And I noticed online the pricing does seem to vary based on the season. So definitely want to just kind of check that out as far as if you maybe go at a different place in the winter. The other thing is, is that wetsuits are provided. So you're plenty warm the whole time that you're in the water because they allow the use of wetsuits. They provide those wetsuits and they also provide a snorkel and mask. Can I take off my gloves and pet the birds now? You mean, I mean, sing My bad, sing right. So it's a bird. This is. <laughs> Hair in the mouth.